In this video, we'll see the next topic that is parameterization using data driver. This is the second method of parameterization. The very first method we have seen using the keyword view. This one is the editor view. We have seen in the previous video how to parameterize using the keyword view. That was the shortcut method. Second, in this video, we'll be seeing how to use with the data driver. Using data driver, you can find out all the parameters, all the values which you can parameterize, right? So let us see that. Now, first thing is I've recorded a sample application that is my flight sample application. And this is the same data like uh, agent name, password, OK button and so on. So all the datas, if you see these values are rigid, they are not as parameterized. Set John, password, Denver, London and so on. You see that's a passenger name, Perman Lalwani. So these are fixed values. These are not yet been parameterized. If you want to parameterize all the value at one go, you can just go to this tools menu bar. And if you see there's a data driver, so click on this data driver you'll get this dialog box. It says in the entire script, in this action, in this entire script, these are the values which you can parameterize. These are all the values. Let's see the first value. This is nothing but the password. It is in the encrypted form, that's the password. Second one is Denver. You see that's a select Denver, that's fly from. John, that is the agent name. And third one, if you see, that's a London. And finally, that's a Pavan Lalwani. So these are all the values. These are right now constants. If you want to parameterize all the values, what you can do is, I'll select the password, click on parameterize. You can see a step-by-step -step parameterization. So if you click on this next button, now these are the values which you can parameterize. These are the options which you can parameterize. But in this version, in the newer version, it is not compatible. So you cannot see the options here, right? So I'll just click on this cancel button, right? That was the first method. Second method is like if I click on this parameterize and if I click on this parameterize all, what I'm trying to parameterize, I'm trying to parameterize this password. So here if I say, configure all instead of this constant value give me some parameter and what is it parameter this is the name of the column okay name of the column i'm not able to understand what exactly it is trying to say so i'll just click on this button here now this is the dialog box you might be already aware of now it says it should be stored into a data table in that data table the name of the column should be this much okay it's a lengthy name i'll cut that name and i'll type here as password typed here password in which sheet do you want in the local sheet or the global sheet so i have said as global sheet okay so i'll select it global sheet click on okay now what has happened is data table name of the column is password okay and here it is in the global sheet dt global sheet dt stands for data table and if i click on finish okay so if you see this password early it was a constant constant was one now it has been parameter so you see there's a one given here and i'll just click on okay so let me see whether actually a column is created into the global sheet or not so i'll just go to this view menu bar click on this data so if you observe here the name of the column is password and here it's the encrypted form so if you want you can keep on typing here so what i'll do is i'll just type here as hp 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 okay so three times i've written here similarly if you want to parameter one more value what you can do is go to tools menu bar I'll go to tools menu bar, click on this data driver. Now let us say if I want to change it to, let's say if I want to change Denver, okay, then I'll click on this parameterize. If you observe earlier, the password was given here. Now it has been removed from this place, right? So I have only four values. So if I click on Denver, click on parameterize, select as parameterize all. Now Denver is nothing but fly from city. So I'll just click on this place and I'll say that should be in the data table in the global sheet but the name of the column should be something else so I'll write as from city so I've typed here as from city click on ok click on finish so if you see Denver early it was constant now it has changed to parameterize now if you see select Denver observe here when I click on ok button select Denver will be changed to data table I'll just click on ok you see select data table the name of the column and the name of the sheet that is data global sheet let me see yeah you see there's a column which is inserted from city and the data is given as denver right so this way you can keep on parameterizing all the values into your script at one go itself right so i hope you're able to understand the next type of parameterization using data driver that's all for this video